With shark populations increasing, there have been more and more sightings along Southern California beaches. We've worked very closely with lifeguard agencies from San Diego to Santa Barbara to develop protocols on how to best advise the public when sharks are sighted. If you go to the beach and you see shark signs, pay attention to those. The lifeguards put those up for your safety and they're important to keep you educated and informed about what you might encounter if you go to a beach. It's always good to stay in a group. Always follow lifeguard instructions. And remember, a crowded beach is a beach where sharks don't tend to visit. So those tend to be the safest beaches. If you do see a shark, what we always recommend is keep your eyes on the shark. Let the shark know that you see it. Most cases when people encounter sharks, the shark's just passing by. It's just checking them out. There doesn't appear to be any signs of aggression or threat. However, if the shark's behavior starts to change, that's when you need to pay attention. So when sharks start coming closer and moving rapidly towards you and rapidly moving away, that's a sign of aggression and that's time when you need to back off. Always keep your eyes on the shark and make sure the shark knows that you're watching it. You can swim slowly and calmly back to the beach. If you encounter a shark and a shark is actually approaching you or a shark bites you, what we recommend is you should hit the shark in the eye, in the nose, or stick your hand in the gills. Those are all sensitive tissues and quite often it causes the shark to release. So in those cases, your first response should be getting yourself to safety as quickly as possible. You wanna yell for help. Don't worry about bleeding. Try to get yourself to the beach as quickly as possible. In most cases where people are bitten, the shark simply bites but doesn't remove flesh and rarely comes back. So we recommend that your primary priority is getting yourself safely to the beach. One of the things we always wanna remember is that not only do we want to keep people safe when we go to the beach, but we want to keep the shark safe as well. We've worked really hard over the last 20 years to bring shark populations back from being overfished. And that's working. We are seeing more and more sharks in our coastal waters and we need those sharks. They are very important animals in our marine ecosystem. They help keep our marine mammal populations healthy and they also help keep our fish populations healthy. We need those sharks in our coastal oceans. We also need to learn to share the ocean with these animals. If you want to learn more about our research and learn more about what we're learning about sharks, you can come to the Shark Lab website, CSULB Shark Lab, our Facebook page, or our Twitter account.